Hey, welcome back to part three to our watch along of MS Tony, the untold story. If you saw us on YouTube, we saw a very cut up version, just like the other two parts. If you haven't seen the other two parts, because we watch the other two parts, um, it's gonna be very cut up because of copyright reasons. If you like to see a full and cut version of this and other Hindi watch alongs, you can head over to Patreon or channel membership. I'll put the link in the description below, pinned comments, so you can go check that out. And at the end of this part, Rick, we will talk about the movie in a ruin. Am I right? <laughs> Good banter. Here we go. Let's finish this movie. Oil can. What? Oil can. He said oil can. Have you ever seen The Wizard of Oz? I knew that's what you were doing. I just. <sighs> Unfortunately, am I right? The next time you have a poo poo, do yourself a favor. Wipe with coarse sandpaper. Okay. For a long, long, long time. Nahi ma puchhi thi tumhare baare mein. क्या बोला तुमने वही जो मैं हमेशा कहती हूँ हम दोस्त हैं आई ट्रस्ट यू बट ये सब स्टूप न्यूज ये मुझे बहुत अपसेट करती है माई आई गेट होट एन आई थिंक आई लव यू दैट्स वाई आई गेट होट अच्छा ये बताओ कल वैलेंटाइंस डे है क्या लू तुम्हारे लिए कल वैलेंटाइंस डे है माई बोलो क्या लू तुम्हारे लिए मैं वैलेंटाइंस वैलेंटाइंस डे नहीं मानता Of course. Have a good match, Mahi. Sakshi, मेरी दुनिया तुम्हारी दुनिया से बड़ी बड़ी नहीं है. एक क्रिकेट के किट बैग के साइज़ की है. तुम्हें ही जेल में. तो सोच समझ के जवाब देना. Will you marry me? Are you sure, Mahi? As sure as I'm of getting a century in the next match. So Sri Lanka end up 274 for six after their 50 overs. The target for India when they come out to bat 275. Now that is a massive score. If a wicket goes down, I think I should go in. But uh, UV is padded up and ready. No, it's Murli. I think I should go in. You sure? Yeah. Just tell him I'll I'll go. That's a stunning catch. Kohli has to depart. India now in a spot of bother. 114 for 3 he's not had the best of world cups with a bat so far but a captain here trying to make a statement massive knock this from the indian captain this is a world cup final he's in the zone he now realizes that he's reached the half century the crowd sense 52 made it off 53 and a pereira on his way he's gone Looking to give himself room, Gautam Gambhir misses it all together. Four runs to win. Eleven balls remaining. What a moment this is! History in the making. Tony finishes off in style. A magnificent strike into the crowd. Does look a good deal like him there. I think that was him in the last frame. Yeah, no, that was. I was, yeah. saying, it, it, I was saying he does look a, a good deal like him there in terms of the, the casting of it. That was nice. It was uh, in terms of a sports biopic movie. Um, fairly standard in terms of what, what's what's going on here. Uh, the only thing that really caught me off guard was I didn't know that his first girlfriend, or not his first yeah. girlfriend, but the one that he was in love with died yeah um that, that was kind of insane um but uh definitely i felt like it was more educational than anything <laughs> in terms yeah of it was you, this is this happened at this point this happened at this point um so i think maybe maybe the flow definitely could have been better obviously it was it's a long movie it's a three-hour movie but um I, I thought it was nice what'd you think uh it it fell short of my yeah. hopes mm -hmm. yeah it 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 uh i um there's a lot of things. I thought there were too many uh, mont songs of montage. Songs. Yeah, it was like we didn't need seven of them. 
I I felt that for a sports movie, it failed to do what most great sports movies do, which is build toward a climactic game and why it's so important to win that game. And you feel the tension of that yeah. throughout the film yeah. so that you have a deep investment. And you're, I mean, I've watched sport movies where I, I can barely sit still. I'm so nervous. Mm -hmm. Even when I know the outcome, yeah. I'm still really nervous about the outcome. And it didn't, it didn't do it, that for it me. It felt like they were trying to say more about about his life fully than just be a full-on sports movie this felt definitely more like well, I, mean, it, yeah, I bet it was tough for them obviously i'm sure everybody knew everything about his life before this <laughs> movie ever came out mm. and so they needed to make each plot point kind of kind of thing as opposed to focusing really on the the end part because i think they probably knew the audience was going to have that emotion attached to that <laughs> point already mm -hmm. uh because they're already big fans of donny but yeah i, I agree I, it, it was it didn't feel like that big climactic moment at the end for me because i obviously i i think i knew that was already the case but it didn't really feel like it was just building up to that it just felt like that was another point in his life more yeah and yeah. it felt like everything for him like his why mm -hmm. was I want to play cricket. And once he was able to play cricket, everything else was just like even in the the final game, I got the feeling that whether they won or lose whether they won or lost, he was just gonna be able to move on and go to the next thing. Mm -hmm. Versus versus the high stakes of what it m was maybe going on i mean i can't imagine this didn't mean a lot to him personally to get the world cup and i just didn't feel like i felt like a lot of this was about what about what he did far more than who he was it, so and it just it, the, the dramaturgy for me that the, uh, the lack of uh just everything just felt kind of snapshotty yeah that's what I was saying. It felt like there was plot point, plot point, plot yeah. point of it, of it, not plot point of the movie, but more of his life. No, just like here's it, a snapshot, here's a snapshot, here's a snapshot, here's a snapshot. Uh, yeah, yeah. I, I I could definitely see that for sure. Um, and how many other biopic sports movies from India have we seen? Bog Milka Bog. That was based off real, right? That was the yeah. real guy. That was, yeah, that one's really nice. Uh, the dongle, dongle was real. Yeah. Okay. Um, I know there is Chalk Day real. I think Chalk Day is real, but I wouldn't bet money on it. <laughs> Eighty three was real, obviously. Yes, this was so was Jersey. Even though there obviously there was issues, I, I wasn't Jersey real. A true story. I don't think so. Oh, I thought it was. I think that was. Uh, let me know if. It, obviously, I don't. I don't want to say it's not, but I don't think it's it too fun. Real? <laughs> <laughs> I don't. I don't think so. I don't think the Tamil one was really that. Was, that felt more just. Yeah, like a, that a, felt a, like more like a drama. So could have been. You I don't know. To, I don't know that for sure. Compare it to other, um, and they don't. There was obviously, um, over dramatization of the score, um, for sure. Uh, even though the the songs were nice, I do agree. There was like it felt like there was a lot of love songs. Way too many. Um, for, for a sport. Even though yeah. Obviously, it looks like those two were pretty significant in his life. The first one that, that died and obviously the, the lady that he married, obviously. Yeah. Um, but it, it definitely felt like there was, per capita, like more uh, <laughs> about that than than more the sport part of it. Yeah. Um, which, obviously, it seems like is the biggest component of his life. I don't know if you would say that. But, um, like, I, I even though... Um, I, I definitely think there were issues. I, like, I enjoyed it more than I enjoyed 83, this movie. And I enjoyed it more than I enjoyed Chalk Day. Uh, Bogmug Bog is definitely better um, in terms of a, a film, for sure. Uh, but it, it de that one felt like they were trying to make a movie. And this one felt like they were just trying to tell the points of his life. Right? Like, yeah. More than, like, make a movie about... Donny, it's no, more like, yeah, it's like places we're going to tell the story of parts of his life. Yeah, I still think, still one of the best biopics about sports, and it's a story of two men, is Chariots of Fire. It is pretty much as good as it gets mm. as far as telling you the personal side of the men, why they do what they do, why it matters, and 
you become very much invested because you get to know so much about them and why they're so important to running and why it matters in this particular Olympics and time and history. And I, I just felt like this, this didn't even, I, I mean, I'm not saying every sport someone has to compare to something like chariots of fire, but, uh, it just, yeah, fell short for me. Mm -hmm. Um, I thought the, uh, uh, don't, I would love to actually see, um, even though at the end he looked like him, I would love to see like the comparison of, um, MS's swing and, um, yeah. and, uh, um, Sushant, uh, and kind of them talking next to each other so I can end the walk and see, uh, cause I'm sure obviously Sushant did a lot of work. It looked like he did a lot of work, um, uh, about him there. I, I thought a lot of the songs were really nice. Um, too many for sure. Um, I would have preferred it. And I know it's a Bollywood movie and it's very emotional for a lot of Indians cause it's about Dhoni. It's about cricket. It's about winning the world cup. Definitely overscored for sure, though. Um, this is one of those. It felt like every scene had a a big uh, overture behind it. Yeah, and I'm it. and I'm pretty sure this will be one of those where whatever we say about our particular viewpoint on it artistically is going to be written off by those who say you just don't get it because you're not Indian and you weren't here during the World Cup. That could be it. Who okay. knows? <laughs> no, that doesn't change the fact. It doesn't matter what sporting event you cover. There's still dramaturgy that happens that makes something whether yeah. it's 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 good or bad. Yeah. So. Um, but, uh, the, I get why more people might like the film than we would and overlook some of the artistic things of it because of what it means to them. More of just a, and it could be that this film was just more of a celebration of him than a full on movie. Maybe. Um, style, which there have been that kind of films before. It was like, yeah, it's just a celebration of whoever this person not, is. Not even a sports film. There's many biopics where the the, the person playing the person, a, a good recent one is the biopic that was made about Whitney Houston. Didn't see it. Didn't see it. A lot of people didn't. It was pretty good. Mm. She was really good mm -hmm. having to portray Whitney Houston. Yeah. So that's an example of, of one that really wasn't received very well, but it, it, it was a it was a good film and she did a very good job portraying Whitney. And that's that's tough. Yeah, that's tough. Um, the big one coming is next year is going to be what? Michael. Oh, yeah, <laughs> that's right. Uh, it's coming next year, isn't it? Yeah. Um, yeah. It's so in terms of sports movie, I didn't think it was it was it was awful or anything like that. But it, it definitely I thought it was going to be more of a movie movie. And it felt like it was more of a almost documentary type. Yeah, like, it didn't even feel like no, a documentary. No, not like I'm not saying it felt like it. Like it, that was, it was like just this is the information about this point. This is the information about this point. Like as opposed to a congruent story. Yeah, it kind of felt like that, I was standing in a room looking at news clippings on the wall. And going, that's what happened. Yeah, uh, that's okay, what happened uh -huh. there. Uh huh. That's what happened. That's there. what happened there. And then they sponsored there. him there. Okay. Okay. Then he his did. girlfriend died. Okay. Yeah, he did some ads. Yeah. Uh, that's and it. So it. It felt like documentary. Not like a, a full documentary. That's what I'm saying. But like. Just the plot points. This is this is what this is what we were getting to, um, and maybe that's what they were going for. Uh, and they just wanted to tell a story about these points in his life. I just thought it was going to be more of a, a of a movie movie. Yeah, um, kind of like Bagma Kabag was in terms of this is his, and then we follow his his journey here. But yeah. you know, um, you guys can let us know uh, what you thought about this movie. Um, I can't. I don't even remember. I know a lot of people said to watch it. Obviously, it's been we've been told to watch it for yeah ever, but I don't remember like what people said about it. It could just be you learn information about Donny. Yeah, and I feel like I did. Yeah, <laughs> so I do and know it, more about Donny now yeah. than I did before. And any of you who saw me post on Instagram my rating system with medals, this is I, it's a it's a it's a reluctant bronze for me. So oh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. You decided to do the bronze. Yeah, the, the, it helped. I mean, platinum, the, uh... gold, silver, bronze. Oh it, yeah, platinum. Platinum is the. Oh wow. The, platinum is platinum is it's an all time favorite. It should win all award season stuff. It's like one of my all time favorites. But it also because gold can be one of my all time favorites, but it might not necessarily be an awards contender. Mm. So for example, gold for me for some of my favorite films would be 
so uh, PK. PK is not necessarily going to be an, an awards contender necessarily, okay. but it's one of my favorites of all time. Mm. Um, if it's silver, I enjoyed it. Um, I would not necessarily watch it again, but if someone had it on and wanted to watch it with me, I, I might watch it. But gold, I obviously I want other people to go see it all the time. Mm. If it's bronze, they tried. It was okay. I'm not going to watch it again. Mm -hmm. And then if it doesn't get a medal, then I I either wished it would end or walked out or have nothing really nice to say. About <laughs> gotcha. It. Yeah. But this doesn't fall into that category. Oh, but you just don't use the alphabet. <laughs> that's right. No, because that that's <laughs> what? It, C? A, a, no. It's the same thing. No, it's not. It isn't <laughs> at all. I'm it isn't at all. In your mind, it's not. No. It's like uh, the difference between an A and a B versus, I mean, and what are you going to qualify something as an A? is an all-time great film, and then the ones that aren't one of the all-time greats, you're giving it a B? That's lame. <laughs> You'd give, I'd give PK a B because it's not platinum? Uh, no, I much prefer that. Besides, it's mine. It's not yours, so go <laughs> suck a rat. You can do, <laughs> no, I can you do whatever the hell I want. That was the last film. That was Shiten. <laughs> Where he was eating. That, that was bronze. That was, uh, that was bronze as well. Uh, anyways, you guys can let us know what you thought about the movie, uh, which will be our next uh, sports movie. Uh, Sushant. Sushant. I uh, believe um, he definitely wasn't the issue with this film at all. No. Uh, um, never is with uh, any film that we've ever seen. No, there wasn't any. That's the other thing is that's why it's a bronze for me is that there's nothing blaringly terrible. The only thing that's really disappointing and could have been a lot better is what the the the, the storytellers and the writers and, and director did with the flow of the dramaturgy as well as the overuse of the music and score. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, but the performances by the actors was all Sushant, fine. Man. And Sushant is a little bit more than fine because he had to step into some really big shoes. Yeah, obviously we can't really no problem judge with his performance. how he did in terms of what was his walk, what was his talk, what was his swing, what was his you guys can Well, I can't tell when they interspersed live footage of, of, of actually Tony swinging. I couldn't differentiate, yeah. so but you guys would know way yeah. better than that. Yeah. I, but again, no problem with really any of the performances. Yeah, at all. Um, but obviously, I think he does. He have like two more that we haven't seen. I know there's that one where he had the song where that person was on his back and he was carrying her up that person up. The yeah, road. we've got it's single digits. We've got left of Shushant's films. So uh, I'm sure that. Very sad. Yeah. Regardless, him. Let us know what our next Hindi watch along should be. If you saw us on YouTube, you saw a very good version because got right reasons. If you like see full uncut version though of this and others. Uh, movies, you can head over to Patreon. I'll put a link in the description below, pinned comments, so you can go check that out. And, uh, on to the next watch along!